Hello. I'm going to use that gun because that, that's a gun that's going to require a lot of accuracy, and we all know I don't really have any. Um, boom! That double dodge, though. Bam. Anyone else? Boop. He's just spawn forever. I could just do this for the rest of the day. Man. Oh, there, there are so few games that make you feel as much as a badass as this game if you do it right. I tell you, man. Can't use the singularity grenade with their hyper cannon? I probably could. Yeah, that's a good idea. Replay Doom? Oh, we're gonna replay Doom. We're actually gonna do a full Doom playthrough, then we're gonna do a 100% run of the new Doom when it comes out. So we are definitely gonna be playing the new Doom again. No question. Oh! Are you a, are you a car? Oh, you aren't. Yeah, I was gonna say, I've never seen that before. Huh. Okay, let's see. Uh, we still need... Oh! We're done. Well, alright then. Uh, oh, there's our mission. Perfect. That worked out well. Let's do this. Can I summon this here? We're not on the road. Yeah, I was gonna say. Okay. Oh, more dudes over here? I don't think I can get over this. These walls are so high. It's like they keep people out or something. Is there anything interesting in here? Oh, no, just some authority bros. There we go. Still can't call it in? Oh. Well, that works. Hey, Asian bro. Did the hover hoverbike randomly unlock for you? Uh, Shizui, the hoverbike unlocks when you get Kavasir's um, level to seven. Each each of these guys has like an unlock, I think, when you get their level high enough. And Kavasir level seven unlocks the helicopter. Or the hoverbike. Whatever, whatever. Is this game worth a buy? 
Um, this game is going to be worth the buy for people that enjoy the gameplay. I'm absolutely loving the gameplay. So for me, this is like a, a hard yes for a purchase. However, I do feel that some people will feel that there's probably less of a narrative than they were expecting. Um, and for people that don't enjoy, for people that don't thoroughly enjoy the gameplay loop, you're probably going to find it a little bit wanting because this game is just all about the gameplay loop. It's all about refining your 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 way of killing enemies, essentially. So I think it's a blast. I'm having a great time with it. But um, I think some people will find it repetitive, especially if they don't it really like fundamentally enjoy the combat. Yes, this is basically a murder simulator. <laughs> That's a good way to say it. So, yeah. What is going on here? Here's one of them bandit dens again. Ooh. I see pebbles. Let's go say hello. Lily, this place has a bad vibe to it. Like Mom would have said, Rangers must assess the dangers in advance and go in ready for anything. Okay, Lucy, I'm here to involve. Keeping my eyes peeled for any signs of authority presence. All right, let me know if you find anything. If you go by reviews, it's the worst game ever. But when I get to watch Ko, he seems to dig it. I don't know what to tell you, dude. I'm loving it. <laughs> I don't know what to tell you. I mean, I'm not faking having a great time. <laughs> so I, I I, don't know, man. I, I got to admit, though. I got to admit. I've watched a lot of streamers play this game. And I've noticed over and over that the people that don't seem to like this game are not using dash are not using melee. They're um, they're not getting an enemy's face. They're trying to stay in a corner and kill that guy that's super bullet spongy and then kill that guy that's super bullet spongy. And it's like, I like if you play the game that way, it does kind of suck. <laughs> it, it does kind of suck. Am I throwing shade? No, absolutely not. Because the way I just said is how you play most games like this. Um, it's It's... The big thing with this game is you don't play it like a normal game. You don't play it like a normal shooter. So, and, and believe it or not, the game kind of almost punishes you if you try to. So, yeah. I, 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 the only thing I can say, rebind your powers and play super aggressively. And it's a really good time. Oh, wait, he was talking about Days Gone? Oh, I, oh, was he? Well, I like Days Gone too, but to be fair, it kind of sucked at the beginning. I, I almost I almost dropped these. That I understand when people say that. But that being said, I think if you give days uh, days gone about seven to nine hours, if you let it get its hooks in you, it worked for me at least. Got a lot better. Let's go ahead and get this stuff before we go. Nope, not this way. Here? 
Maybe behind this wall? Oh, yep. Look at that. Great. How are we looking here? Two more storage containers and an art chest? I mean, this place is so big. Oh. Something this way. Walker, you got anything? Nope, not yet. I'll keep looking. It's gotta be up there. Is there anything down here, though? Oh, it looks pretty clear. Have I ever done a DOS 2 playthrough? Oh yeah, it's all my YouTube. We're gonna be doing another one, hopefully this year at some point. I'm, I'm really looking forward to playing it again. No guys? I thought this upper area would be flooded with dudes. Okay, we're really close to it. Where was it? No, it's not here. We started getting close to it somewhere over here. Here we go, here we go. Oh, it's probably up there. Oh, oh maybe we're gonna be going in a building. Oh, no, there they are. Oh, is that it? Come on, man. I need more pebbles to shoot. Oh, I was just kidding. Kill one of those. Apparently, attacking them from behind is the way to do it. Hey, it's Bikiest Man! What's he doing up here? Nice. Okay. Am I gonna play Borderlands 3 on release? Oh, hell yeah, dude. We're doing a Borderlands franchise playthrough before Borderlands 3. Yep, yep. Looking forward to it. It's been a long time since I played the Borderlands game, so it's going to be a fun refresher. Looks like Epic Games is having a sale and their store is adding $10 off every game worth $13.99 and up. Wait, so a $13.99 game would be $3.99? My lord, dude. I guess when you have a huge amount of money and nothing to do with it, and all of your shareholders are fat and happy already. <laughs> hey, go for it, dude. Good for them. We made enough money recently. Where am I going? Look for signs of the authority. Okay, there's one. Shooting his little metal paint. Um, maybe something down here? Is this whole... Is the whole area? Oh, no, no, there's like a, a distinction here. There's an actual point we're going to. Did we get all the things? Yeah, we're good here. Uh, let's see. Maybe a data pad or something? This is where all the big fight happened up here, so... Hey, Christopher G. What's up, dude? Uh, I'm probably just being a big dumb right now. Oh, oh, there we go. I wonder. Agar, Maybe the giant authority kind of base in the side of the mountain. Leading I don't into know. the mountain. That this is it. Yeah, I'm going in to find out. Oh, there's Look the dude. Yeah. Clegg Clayton's little chopper. Is 
Let's see how powerful this thing is. Nobody's in here? Whoa! Oh, you know what? I bet you were going to have a big fight on the way out. General, I hope that today's display didn't cause you to doubt the path we were on. Of course, it is unfortunate that our Demi-Titan was able to carve its way through three members of my team on its way out of the testing facility, but I take heart in knowing that it took a great deal of firepower to bring it down. I believe that the creature is simply not intelligent enough to be trained. This should have been obvious to me in the way it tore apart the last four people that attempted to train it, but I was keen to show you what it could do. I will focus more on the neural interface before the next iteration. General Cross, I understand your hesitation in developing our Titan prototype and appreciate your offer of support while we work on assembling the resources needed. In the meantime, part of my team has been working on a set of Demi-Titans. These creatures still stand approximately four times taller than your average human and can be equipped with a wide range of weaponry. We've been developing a weapon based on the cutting lasers that we use to create space in our labs currently sits inside. I think we could attach it to a Demi-Titan. What do you think? Oh, so Demi-Titans are what we've been fighting the whole time. That The big guy that we just fought at the uh, rank 10 arc. That must have been a Demi-Titan. Did I upgrade the hyper cannon? I don't think so yet. This oh the the hyper cannon not at all. No. Um, this one we maxed out, which I'm really liking. This one we need to max out. Do I have any of these left? I do. Uh, let's do this and this. Nice. Uh, get quick lock. Instantly lock onto targets. Oh, that's kind of big. Um. Okay, cool. The hyper cannon will go ahead and unlock this. Armor Breaker Shockwave. A single shot damages all armor parts on the enemy. Ooh. Cartridge capacity. Gives it six shots. And then charge efficiency is probably what we want to get. All right, cool. We'll keep an eye on that. I think the full Titan was a creature from the beginning. Yeah, yeah, I agree. I, I think that's the, the Titan we've been reading about the whole game, I'm pretty sure, is the... When they built that guy is when they attacked Vineland. Yeah. Sir, I've done it. The neural interface for the Demi-Titan has, a, a, has been a complete success. The use of a brain zygote has not only yielded a much more focused and aggressive specimen, but has allowed us to control it with rudimentary training and the application of a neural interface. This allows me to program the creature to not only respond to orders, but it will almost it will be almost incapable of violence towards anyone I command it to obey. With this technology in place, I'm keen to push forward with our Titan upgrade. We are so close to taking back the surface. Let's go. Aeon Ruby. Oh my god, there's this thing called Twitch Prime. You can connect your Amazon account and sub for free here. So wild. You mean people can support me in everything I do here for absolutely free if they have Amazon Prime? I can't believe it. They're building, well, thanks. building these titanic mutant monsters here. They may be Appreciate preparing it, buddy. for more attacks like violence. Holy shit, what did I just miss? Hello? Fuck. Breaking up. Uh, okay, let's just get this was, vision core and get the hell out of here. Was there another one up there? Excuse me, the creeps. Oh, we don't need to be attacking these things. Dude, are we going to fight that thing at the end? I guess we are. Oh, dude, that's going to be awesome. What's this guy talking about? I have been more than patient with you, Mr. Clayton. If you cannot deliver Wellspring to me, then I will have to take it by force. Hey, hey, we have a deal, Cross. Let me remind you that I will let you in as soon as I take the mayor's seat. Oh, your little dream of becoming mayor. I appreciate your dedication, Mr. Clayton, but let me assure you that was never going to happen. You made me a promise. <laughs> you lied to me. And to Clay Clayton, you lied. I would have preferred to take Wellspring quietly, but Blood and Thunder will have to do. But I am Clint Clayton! Aim away from his face. I want to preserve his what, what, cadaverism what, what? memento. No, I, I can go for whatever he's paying. Oh, no! 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 O
Have you used the drones yet? Only a little bit. To be honest, the drones kind of slow me down. I'm, I'm, I do things so quickly as it is that I really haven't found a, a real kind of use for them yet. It's good to distract the enemies, but... Four shotgun shots to kill those guys. It's kind of obscene. Great. You gotta go fast, that's right. No way, Nuriel. Are you serious? Please tell me you're serious. Hey, Zikotakus, what's up, buddy? Dude! The voice of Clegg is the voice of Schizo! That's so perfect! Oh my god, that's so perfect. Oh, wow. <laughs> I love to hate him. <laughs> co rage, co gun, that's right. That, v that voice actor is great at playing douchebags. I know, right? He really does a great job. Man. He managed to make two people be completely unlikable assholes. That's a talent. That's a talent. I didn't go backwards, did I? I don't think so. Did I? Ew. In these levels, this feels so much like Doom. So much like Doom. Holy shit, look at that, dudes. Oh, that is badass. Gotta get across. That was good. Boop. Shoot it? I'm not touching that thing. Nope. Nope. Hi, friend. Okay. Nope. 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 Come on. Get out. Get out. Kill Die. Sinking City is confirmed for June 27th. Awesome! Great! Can't wait for that one. Oh, that's an arena if I've ever seen one. 
This big door is going to open and a big old dude is going to come out. Here we go. Let's do this. Get that flow down. Stop bullying them. Beautiful. That's unfair. You're not even giving him a chance. I am kind of a bully, to be fair. Full disclosure, goes a bully. Does game stutter for me sometimes? Uh, only when I'm driving. Sometimes I have some weird stutters when I'm driving around the world, but generally when I'm doing like the big combat sequences, it's it's pretty smooth. Do, do, do. I kind of hope there's a harder difficulty that unlocks when we beat the game. I, if they do a DLC difficulty for this game, I might check that out. Hey, same man, what's up, buddy? Oh, a permadeath mode. Oh, I don't, uh, I don't know about that. I've, I've died in a few very cheap ways in this game. I, I don't think I do a permadeath mode. Sometimes the deaths are a little much. in the wrong button. Probably helps if I hit the right button to heal. So I heard. I read that on Reddit. Oh, try the new gun on him. Oh, it's a great idea. We should. We should try that. Maybe the new, maybe that'll like actually bust his armor off or something. We'll try that next time we see one of those. I'm there. sure we'll see. Feltrite fission core. Nasty. Have to cut the power to reach it. 